What's up, YouTube friends and family? I'm Elvis. And I'm Michelle. And today we are in Georgia. And we are in a very small, small hidden town. What's it called again? Arnco Sergeant. Arnco Sergeant. Very strange little place. Uh, it looks very poor. There's a lot of abandoned houses. There's garbage everywhere. It looks like a pretty rough place. And I know from speaking to people around the area that this is uh, this place has a bad reputation for drugs. Yeah, it's an incorpor unincorporated town, so there's not even any information really online as far as population and stuff like that. I mean, they do have a elementary school, but I mean, there's nothing really online. I guess because there's it's one unincorporated. Store, one convenience store. Yeah. We did another previous video in Sargent, Georgia, and this is around the same area. Look at that, guys. So we're in West Georgia. Man, this place is like, oof, it's, it's rough. And there's not even a downtown area. We're just going through the neighborhoods. We were out on a little Sunday drive, and we just had to share this because it's, it's pretty rough. So we're just going to go through some of these little neighborhoods and show y'all the condition that these people are living in. There's a lot of just abandoned houses and then there's just a lot of trash houses with just trash everywhere. A lot of abandoned cars. Uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely a sight to see. Very interesting. I guess we can speed up a little through here. There's no <laughs> houses or nothing here. Whoa. Yeah, we gotta go over there and show them that. And then we'll come back this way. Okay. Check this out, guys. <clears throat> just fell in yeah I don't even see how it's still standing you'll see y'all see it's it's a couple of houses up right here on the left past these trucks but half the house is literally just caving in look at that like I don't understand <laughs> that is so that is so crazy look at the um, the beams on the front like they're just yeah. split yeah, that is crazy. Wow. Mm -hmm. This place is a little creepy. And then, and then you have some really pretty houses just kind of thrown in the mix. So it's not like all the houses are in that rough shape. There's just a lot of them. Yeah. And then you'll have, you know, a few houses that are really pretty and can tell the people are taking care of them but it's it's just sad to see a neighborhood like this where there's so much yeah it has despair yeah I mean. it has potential it's a, a quiet cool little hidden town but but it's it, it's sad for the people that live here that are trying to you know have a nice house and live in a nice area and there's just so many people that are, are not doing that yeah. some of these houses you wouldn't you wouldn't think that people live in them because of the rough conditions they're in but there are definitely people living in a lot of these old little beat up houses and you have this little white house on the yeah, corner cool. here that's just as cute as it can be one of those places where you don't see nobody outside nobody yeah, it's, it's a sunday afternoon about three o'clock a little cool out today it's about 50 degrees i 
this road we're about to go down right now is it has some houses that are in very rough shape side right here then we're gonna come back and show you guys the other side because there's some pretty interesting stuff you guys might want to see on the other side yeah when we have the camera focused in the middle a lot of times you just don't get all the detail that we're seeing yeah so we're trying to just do kind of one one side of the road at a time where it looks like there's somebody living in there. It could be. Yeah. And then some of them, you know, it looks like people are trying to fix them up. Yeah. Maybe. That one's pretty nice. Yeah. Oh. I just don't understand. I always say this. I just don't understand <sighs> the garbage aspect of this. I mean, that's the thing, you know, it's not like we fault to anybody that just doesn't have the money to <laughs> to redo their complete house, but you can always choose to throw your garbage where, <laughs> I mean, where it's supposed to go. Yeah, I'll just dump it in the front yard. For the whole neighborhood to have to yeah. look at every day. This is a nice one right here. Yeah. Is it a white one? It is cute. Yeah, that's pretty cool. The little blue one or bluish gray one right here on the left. I mean that's just adorable. Yeah. little town has a reputation for so I've heard from several people I don't know anybody here but that there's a meth problem here you ever heard that mm. from you <laughs> huh. it's got a nice porch on it oh this one's nice yeah mm -hmm. it's got his Modelo bottles hanging I mean right there on the uh -huh. front porch Alright y'all, check out this corner house right here. So this is what we're talking about, about the whole trash. I mean, this, I mean, this person really doesn't have trash though. It's just like little trinkets but, and honey, decorations. and. Look at all the trash pots, <laughs> Dr. Thunder boxes. And, oh my God. Yeah. Alright, let's see what else we see down here. y'all drop us a comment if y'all know anything about Arnco Sargent. Yeah. If you've ever been through here. So it's about, um, what would you say, probably 20 minutes away from Noonan, yeah. Georgia. Noonan's probably the closest, closest big place. bigger city. And then on the other side, 
probably what 10 15 minutes away from Whitesburg Georgia mm -hmm. which is a really small town you see the car with all the yeah. car fender with all the beer cans I've noticed like that that's you see that a lot around here there's I've like never a, seen that there's all. people no no I mean there's people that throw beer cans in their front yard so there's some houses that just have like hundreds of <laughs> beer cans in front of the house on the ground they just throw them out the window or out the f door should I do that? We have something called a trash can, oh, you right. know, that we put beer bottles and cans in. But it does stay full a lot of times. Hmm. <laughs> we like our beer. Damn, look at the size of those trees right there. This is a dead right. end, right? Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, look at this little house. Oh, wow. oh gosh. so tiny that's a the one of the original tiny homes look oh, at that wow. guys damn this is before tiny homes ever yep. were you know popular look at these trees in front of this house they're massive <clears throat> closed for what like a, I mean probably a year or so mm -hmm, yeah. we thought they were gonna repair it but more beer cans in, on the floor let's see what is in here huh, warning dangerous dog huh. hmm. I have a feeling that this place has high property crimes Mm-hmm. I'm sure. Probably drug related. Yeah, yeah. with our camera. Oh, we don't know what happened, but I don't know. let's see. Is there a drop of water or something? I don't know, y'all. Our preview failed, so we don't know if it's still recording. So we'll see y'all on the next video. Yeah. Sorry about that, guys. Hope y'all enjoyed this it's video. Not, it's not recording anymore. It's weird. 